Who's it going, fellow listeners? My name is Christoph Soares. Today we're going to be checking out D. Dione's Sarad Midrange Shaman deck. So, I think we should be, uh, I think we're going to go with the more offensive approach here. So, this is uh, kind of a slow start. So, hopefully, I mean, he only threw back one card, so, might be in a bad spot. But we do get the Totem Golem now. That's kind of nice. Um, I think we should be okay with this. Shouldn't be too bad if he plays a uh, Tunnel Trog. Unless he coins out two of them, then that might be a problem. And of course he does. Hmm. <clears throat> Yeah, this is not looking too good, boys. Yeah, this is like the best start that he could have had, so feels bad, man. Hopefully he doesn't get healing totem or taunt totem. Alright, cool. crazy how if he got the 50-50 there, we'd probably be losing the game even more. And we're still in a pretty bad spot here. <laughs> so stupid, dude. It's actually pretty good. Nice. I was kind of lucky. I was actually pretty lucky. Wool. Yeah, I think we have to guarantee killing that. It, obviously, if I get Spell Power Totem, it's a better play to play that and then, like, both things from below, but that's a 1 in 25, and I don't really, I can't, I don't think I could really take that risk. I'm already low on health. Damn it, dude. <laughs> he has, like, all the answers. Ugh. He just, had a, he just had a way better start than we did. Feels bad, man. Pretty much need him to not have Lightning Storm here. It's a pretty good turn though. Filled up the board nice. But yeah, if he has like double Lightning Storm, I think we lose, right? Yeah, we do. Oh my god. That's not that good, but could be good. A mail storm. Nope. All right, that's fine. <clears throat> that's incredible. Wall. Wow, he had a pretty good turn though. Crap.
healing to them? Yeah. Oh yeah. Healing totem skill. Maybe we should have actually just dropped one of these. <clears throat> Lol. Lol. You're old high on, like, oh my god, dude. Alright. Feels bad, man. Lol. I guess we rolled high too, so that's cool. Yeah, I still feel like we're probably not gonna win this. Oh my god. Stupid. Hmm. That's that's pretty good, I guess, for us. Still a pretty close game. He's drawn way more cards than we have though. Four more, it's crazy. Ew, don't kill it. Damn it, dude. Need to roll spell power here. There we go. That is incredible, thank you. Thank you there, real. Alright. So yeah, pretty much because we rolled spell power there, we're like in the game still. If we didn't roll spell power, we were gonna lose. Wow, he has a freaking earth shock in this deck? What the hell? Who the hell runs earth shock? I wonder if that's bloodlust, the wolf. <laughs> now you're gonna have to take it, boy. He just squelched us. I'm pretty sure he just squelched us, the wolf. I don't think there's any way he can win now. Lightning storm? No. Top deck lightning storm. Yep, I knew it. I knew he had the bloodlust. That's what you get for playing bloodlust. I think we keep the lightning bolt, right? I guess just in case. I don't really see why not. Hex is pretty good against Druid, typically. bad thing about this is if he has wrath but kinda willing to take that risk If we play something big here, we can hex it, so I don't mind him like innervating here. 
If he plays Mire Keeper, that kind of sucks. Wow, he got the freaking wrath, dude. What the hell? Stupid. Well, wow, he had Wild Growth, Living Roots, Wrath, and Mire Keeper all in like the top seven cards of his deck. It's crazy. Actually insane. We have both hexes if you play something big, so it's pretty nice. Um I wonder if he even has anything here. Nurse would be really bad for us. Okay, that's fine. I don't really care. Good job, man. Good job, man. We got it. This is a taunt. I might play this. Yeah, I didn't want to play it. Because then he can't just uh, hero power into it. He has to do a little more than that. A giant. Haha. -ha. If we get a uh, Thunder Bluff, it's going to be really good. I can also play this next turn, too. Just kind of depends on what he does. Hmm. Might have to kill that, I guess. Hmm. He's really lucky we don't have Thunder Bluff, though. Oh, hey, there it is. Skill. Alright, now the question is, what do we trade in? I guess we trade in all these. Yeah. Alright. It's fine, I guess. Kinda sucks because we lose our taunt, but... I'm pretty sure that this was still the right play. We can also play this next turn. We got Rag next turn. We got Hex. I mean, we got, we got a lot of options here. I don't think he really has anything because he's just like playing the giant, the, the emperor. He's already used one wrath and living root, so he needs like swipe in one of those, I guess. Or yog, I was going to say. If he plays yog too, yeah, that's, that's definitely an option. <clears throat> Lol. Lol. Yeah, kill all the one ones. Good job. Good job, man. You did it. He didn't really play that many spells, right? Yeah, I was gonna say. <laughs> he shouldn't really have anything else. <laughs> ah, warrior. If I knew it was control, I might keep the mana tide, but. I'm not sure if it's control or not. We have both of our hexes already. It's kind of awkward. So hopefully he doesn't have axe, but if he does, I guess he's using his coin right now, so... Eh. And if he doesn't have it, then it's going to start getting kind of dicey in here. Oh yeah. Yeah, I was pretty sure he had it. I think it's right for him to wait. It takes an extra two damage, but I mean, really, what does that matter? Taunt totem's really good. That's all I was hoping for. Leave it. Monkey. 
Okay, so it is mid range. Um. Hmm. I guess I gotta do this. Cool. If this was healing totem, it would have been better. This is really bad to ravaging ghoul. Actually, I think this is the worst one that I could have got. Feels bad, man. He has both axes already? What the hell? Alright, whatever. Still pretty bad to Ravaging Ghoul. I mean, I guess we could have played this. But it looks like he doesn't really have... Okay. Eh. Feels bad, man. No. Alright, Spell Power Totem? Spell Power Totem. Alright. Maybe we should have just hexed this actually. No. Hmm. This really sucks because of the overload. Now we're not going to be able to Sarad next turn. It was bad, man. Probably going to have to hex something. He'll probably trade into everything. I don't know. Maybe that was a misplay. Yeah, I'm not sure. We really needed the uh, Spell Power Totem, I feel like. Damn. Tom Totem's still cool, but. We're not getting as lucky on our totems this game. Slam. Cool. Alright, at least not develop anything else. Yeah, this is bad. I guess I gotta just play this. He doesn't have axe anymore. If that's any consolation for playing this, I don't know, but. Because if we don't play it, then all we're doing is, um,. I really want to play Brag here. I mean, I guess technically we don't have to play Brag here. I mean, if we hit this, it's really good. If we hit face, I think that's still fine. It's just if he has an execute, we get wrecked. So I think I have to hex this. Eh, YOLO. So next turn we can rag in Lightning Bolt. That's pretty cool. Yeah, it's just really bad. I mean, I guess I, I could have YOLO drag. I don't know. It's just really risky, like, let's see, he would be down to 11 health if we hit face. It's just really bad if he has an execute. I feel like he does have an execute in his hand. Just by, like, the way he's pl been playing. Uh, I feel like he hasn't really been playing cards from the left side that much. But I also haven't been paying attention.
Yeah, dude. No, I can't use this in my video. Hmm. I think we just keep the trog, right? Lightning bolt. Okay, yeah, this is this is a way better hand. This is a really good hand. The thing about rogue though is it's kind of scary for us. This is a pretty pretty nice overload for a trog setup. We'll see if we can get something off for it though. Might not have much for it. Hmm. All right, we got to play the golden one. Just so he knows, we drew the golden one. So yeah, we'll probably play this in the feral spirit. It's really good. Skill, skilled shaman player. Well, feels bad, man. So we can Feral, and then the following turn we can uh, Totem and Lightning Bolt. Alright, I was going to say, if he has Deadly Poison, it feels bad, man. This is a really insane start, though. It's very, very good. I don't know if he's going to be able to win this game. He's going to need a really crazy... Like a super crazy... Auctioneer turn. It's already turn 5, lol. Lol. Damn it, dude. God, I hate Shaman Stone. Lol. Skill. Yeah. yeah. It's Friday, Friday. this feels bad man let's save the coin so one hex down feels bad man Just playing that empty board. Right? Yeah, that's anyway, this is spell power.
Damn it, dude. If that was spell power, it would have been so much better. Crap. I like how he just gave us the Thunder Bluff, though. Feels good, man. He didn't even get any value off of it. Maybe it's a Fire Alley. Mailstorm Portal? Wow. It's so boring. What are you doing? <laughs> what are you doing? Ugh. 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 Help. Somebody help. Mailstorm portal. Good job, man. Holy shit, he's roping me for this. Holy shit, dude. Party and party and hit. Alright, next turn we can use coin on the Thunder Bluff. Should be pretty good. Feels bad, man. I guess at least it died. He actually misplayed that. He should have uh, not done that. Should have taken more face damage. Oh my god, just play your cards, dude. Holy crap. No totem for you. Oh, totem for you! Ho ho! I'm gonna play Rag next turn, hopefully. Well, that's his second hex. Yeah, that's his second hex. There's no hex for Rag now. Feels good, man. I think the only way I won't play Rag is if he gets a Thunder Bluff here, I guess. He's misplaying so hard. Hmm, that's kind of nice too, but I think we should do this. Yeah, alright, if you guys enjoyed this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. For those of you guys watching through YouTube, I'm going to put the deck list in the description below, so you go check out the deck on her phone. And like always, thank you all so much for watching, I'll catch you in the next video. Stay chill. Peace out.